Hi, so we're going to show you here how a your Windows database can transfer messages to the Reiner handheld printer and mark your products with ink. So in this case it's a Reiner JetStamp 1025 printer. It's a handheld inkjet printer and this company, Markor Woodwork, had a unique problem that was each of these cabinets has many panels and they had a unique number and size to them. So they were doing the old way was to handwrite on each board and their new way now with this inkjet system is to have a barcode, a unique barcode and number on the edge of each board that would be assembled into become a cabinet. So, you know, in a nutshell, each number has a specific place that's uh, say the size of the panel, the location of the, the cabinet and such. So in this case, they, they built a jig, a custom jig to go around the inkjet printer, which helps with the alignment of the print. So this is normal for uh, in some manufacturing to have to do that. And then once you have your jig made, you can then look to your database of information. So in this case, he's using Excel and his Excel, he's created um, fancy macros and things to make it even more easy and efficient. You can see the uh, information here on, in those cells is what's going to be transferred. Now that data is in the printer itself. So all that exact message is now here and he will now be able to print directly on the boards. And to print, there's three buttons that you could choose from any one of those red buttons to make the self-traversing printhead mark the boards. Unfortunately, you can't see it right here, but the, the printhead is marking it. And then it, uh, in this case, you, you wanted to use barcodes as well to, to streamline the system even more uh, than just the written numbers. So here are some more examples of uh, some of the boards and some of the handwriting that uh, was happening before they decided to make this new innovative way with unique barcodes and the actual numbers printed very legibly with the inkjet printer. So these panels will be scanned throughout the process. In this case, say maybe uh, they went to the paint shop, then they would be able to scan that information and bring up what proper colors to use or the assembly area when they assemble the cabinets and then when they're shipping them off to the have them installed all of this data could be brought up uh, at specific points where needed. So here are the three steps, the, the you know, into the database first, then it transfers to the jet stamp with a Bluetooth, and then it transfers, you print it directly on your product surface. So that's the three steps. You can see how accurate this is compared to handwriting and the, the savings that he will have in time and, and money and the human errors will be eliminated. So, you know, they're, they're extremely happy with the system, how it worked for them. In this case, labels with adhesive would not work because they might fall off. And then these are just a few f other samples of prints that they were doing. And so that's a summary of that. And if you'd like to subscribe to our YouTube channel, we have more videos like this that may help you. Thanks again.